hello in this video we will see the um, introductory part or some basic part of the applet program in java so as uh, we know in java we can make two types of application one is standalone applications uh, and uh, which uh, normally runs on our, uh, runs on our systems only or and another one we can uh, another type of application we can develop in using java is web based application so in web based application uh, those applications which can run on the internet or which can run in any java enabled uh, web browsers uh, so that uh, applications comes under the web based application so in web based application we can use the applet programs or we can uh, go to the uh, swings or jframe in java but here we will see uh, java applets only and uh, so uh, java applet programs are uh, totally different from the uh, standalone programs or the programs uh, which you were uh, you have seen in this uh, video series uh, so they do not uh, uh, applet program do not uh, have anything uh, related to the to those programs or those concepts here so uh, in uh, any applet may basically applets are some kind of animations or, or graphical representation of the pictures or shapes or text so these applets have their own life cycles so applets have basically four stage in the life cycle first one is uh, applet initialization and means uh, the applets got all uh, variable declaration and all types of declaration in the initialization part and we write uh, init function for the initialization of the applet and similarly uh, after the initialization our applet can uh, start actually uh, start uh, so for applet start we use start start method and that start method actually start the execution of any applet and the graphics start showing in the web browser or in applet viewer or okay and another one is uh, stop method and uh, this is used for the uh, pausing the or uh, stopping uh, our applet program and uh, next one is destroying destroy so okay destroy method so this destroy method completely destroy the applet program so uh, this uh, init method what happens in init uh, in init method applets got initialized means the variables that are being declared in the initial init method that will be that will get a memory in the computer uh, ram or you can say primary memory and as we call a start method uh, our applet program will uh, start executing and a, a stop method will stop our applet program but this will not uh, actually throw out the applet program out of memory it will only uh, you can say pause our applet program and uh, if we have stopped our applet program we can resume or restart using a start method or applet program and destroy destroy method will completely uh, uh, throw in the uh, applet program out of the memory means it, it will clean the memory area reserved by the java program or java applet program so these are two mm, th sorry four mm, important methods that can be used in applet program but uh, mm, before going uh, to these methods we will see some you can say simple applet uh, program say here and so what we have to do uh, in applet program we have a applet class and uh, we can extend our class with the applet and we will override the some methods so uh, to use applet class or methods uh, to construct a applet we have to um, we have to import uh, two package first one is in awt for we uh, abstract window til toolkit package and another one is applet package itself so i will import the two package here obviously java dot import awt 
and uh, I will import the all classes of the AWT or if you want to know uh, which class belongs to the AWT so these are the basically classes that uh, are present in the uh, AWT package so you can if you want to do lots of more in applet or you want to go in the swing java swing or jframe you know to this or you ca you you have to know these uh, classes uh, and uh, use of these classes but here we will see only uh, app some basic classes of applet so i will import simply import the all classes and i will import another package java dot applet so in applet uh, there are uh, some classes like applet itself and uh, three interfaces that is um, applet context applet stuff or uh, add uh, audio clip so i will import all of the classes and interfaces so now uh, we have to create a class and it should be public class and mm, i will name this abc and uh, we have to extend the our class with the applet so here uh, main you uh, main class or main method is not required in the applet program so i will simply extend this class uh, applet class and this applet class is present in the applet package now we have uh, extended our class from by applet class we have to override some methods like um, if you, you want to draw anything on the applet window or uh, you have to use a paint method we have to a o override paint method and paint method is present in the uh, java awt package uh, so uh, here we, i will override the paint method like in uh, thread you override uh, run method similarly here we have to override the paint method so i will write public void paint and inside the paint method uh, anything which is drawn on the app which is to be drawn on the applet window will be written inside the paint method body of the paint method and paint method takes a argument uh, like in a normal um, java program or standalone java program uh, we provide a string type of argument to the main method similarly here we will provide uh, our graphics graphics class that is present in java awt package object to the paint method now we can access the uh, methods of the graphics class uh, through object g so uh, let's uh, print uh, something like uh, this is uh, my applet program or welcome to the applet program here so i will write g dot draw a string you have to know uh, all methods of the graphics uh, class one by one to make any shape to make any animation on the applet window so you you have to go through this uh, so i will write here java string and here i will write first uh, argument text the uh, a string object so i will write here uh, directly i will i, I can write uh, welcome to sorry welcome to java not java applet program okay now uh, second uh, parameter takes the uh, coordinate of the uh, applet or uh, you can say a starting point of the uh, a string welcome to applet program so first one takes x coordinate and second one will take y coordinate and uh, mind you in the uh, in the computer this window since uh, in normal maths or uh, graph uh, the x and y coordinate start from the left uh, bottom corner from here 
but in apple in computer the xy coordinate will start from the left top corner so in, uh, as you move towards the uh, right the x coordinate will increase and as you move towards down and the y coordinate will increase so i i am giving here uh, like uh, 50 pixel uh, right and uh, 50 pixel down okay so uh, i will execute this program applet window has uh, in initialized or uh, displayed here and in the applet window you can say uh, it takes 50 from top and 50 from 50 pixel from left and then it starts the welcome to applet program so uh, you can change the positions also so i am writing here 100 pixel so it will take the 100 pixel from f uh, x coordinate and uh, 50 pixel from y coordinate and that is uh, from left and from top so i will execute this and here it takes uh, 100 pixel from the left and uh, 50 pixel from the top and it prints welcome to applet program and uh, in this uh, application is uh, running in the applet viewer and applet viewer is the application in which you can run your applet program so this is very simple program of applet you can uh, make uh, or you can give a set the color to your uh, the text that is printing on the applet window so for the uh, setting color uh, we will write g dot set color and here i can write the name of the color so i have written red sorry <laughs> we cannot pass red uh, because it's not html we have to write here color that is a class and color dot now uh, i can choose any of the uh, color here or i can write also red so now it will uh, it we have set uh, sets the color of the uh, object that which should that will be drawn on the applet window as it did so this will print in red color welcome to applet program so uh, this is how we can make our uh, applet program in next video we will uh, see some shapes uh, that can be drawn using object of the graphics sheet